Damn. This is a great start screen. This is a great start screen. Holy shit. All right. All right. I just want to see what this is like. Now lying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of people are saying the performance of the game is quite good. Can you hear me? Geppetto's puppet. We need your help. Sick. Well. Camera's a little floppy. Hang on a second, hang on a second. I gotta... I gotta get freaky here. That's better. Ah. There you are. I've been looking all over for you. Oh. Well that did it. The V-Sync was doing it. I was looking on your guys' end. We still good? And yeah, now we're running at 120, like, no problem. Animations are great! Holy shit! Holy shit! We got tearing. Damn it. Really? A bit in the middle? Fuck. We good now? Dude, this animation is just Bloodborne. How funny. I see they got Jiminy too. But we have to hurry. Gemini, Jiminy. Please come to Hotel Crot and I'll explain what's happening. Jiminy, please escort him to the hotel. I haven't figured out how to run yet. Yeah, Jiminy Cricket. Let's this is out of there. Find something that might help. Already probably one of the most high quality souls likes I think we've run into, you know? I mean it's already I'm like ten seconds into this shit. Okay, there is now a UI, so let me move my face. Okay. Still can't run though. But the streets are not safe. Arm yourself with one of the weapons over there. Cool art. It'll be helpful on your way to the hotel. Path of the cricket, path of the bastard, path of the sweeper. Uh Let's go with balance. Destination hotel court. Recommend escaping from this location. Might have to increase the brightness ever so slightly. It's very dark. God damn. Okay, this is a good looking game. Damn, boy. Okay. Left arm of steel. That's LB plus Y. I actually have a guard. These people dead? They're dead. Oh, this is very bad.
cool. Busy playing Final Fantasy. Oh god, I pressed the wrong button. Ow. This feels pretty amazing. He has a Dark Souls roll. Ain't got no Bloodborne roll. He's got a Dark Souls roll. Welcome to Crop Station, everyone. Saw Here you will witness the most spectacular display of human endeavor on Earth. If Crop is your final destination, we wish you a safe and prosperous day. Huh. Maximum number of pulse cells has increased. To recover HP, there's a maximum number of pulse cells can be used. When you reach the maximum, the cell will be discharged. If you attack enemies while the cell is discharged, pulse cell will be gradually charged. What? 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 Um, recover HP. I'll use that when I need to, but it's got like a gimmick to it? Funny. Rat Exhibition 18xx, witness the greatest show on earth. Huh. Cool. Damn. Fucking cool. This guy seems angry with me. Whoa. It broke his weapon? What the hell? It broke his weapon. The enemy's weapons can break? Interesting. Sawtooth wheel. What is these sawtooth wheels? Um, activate the upper belt slot. Activate the lower belt slot. Use the selected belt item. Uh, A, hold down to activate the extra bag. Gotcha. Gotcha. Whatever this is. What am I doing? Cool. Oh, it's like a lantern. Huh. Oh, weapons need repair. Interesting. It's like a sharpness thing. Can I run faster? There you go, it's B. I don't even know what my other gimmick thing is. You need a Krat Central Station key. Okay. Boxes can be destroyed. Oh, shit! Oh, I got shot. I'm pressing X, square to attack. Stupid Final Fantasy. Ow, shit! Lock on. Fable Catalyst. Dim Ergo Fragment. I'm using all this shit and I don't want to be using it. Okay, they don't have goofy souls jump. I'm, so I'm shocked that could actually be popped open and destroyed. Hang on a second. Cathedral Ward ain't looking so good. Oh god! I wonder if that takes away... It takes away a little bit of life. A little bit of life. Try to get this timing. 
I guess the sawtooth wheel is uh for I guess that's for sharpening. Oh, it's a tossable. How weird. Cool. Can you sneak up on people? Yeah, you can. Does it change the color? Yeah, nice. And I screwed it up. Uh, this game's fucking awesome. Uh, this game's like fucking awesome. Holy shit. Yeah, this is this is already feeling like the uh the best souls like out there. If anyone finds this note, get out of the station and run. Definitely make sure to keep clear of the waiting room. I saw a huge puppet smashing people to death in there. I locked the door, but I don't know if that'll work. At least it stopped people from randomly coming in. I'm gonna die soon, so I want to help you even though if it's not much, please survive. God damn. God damn, dude. The atmosphere is amazing, too. And the fact that there's drip in the game, you actually get gear? Okay, so there's probably a guy that's gonna jump out. Shit. Ah! Hey, man. I need to get this timing. Um. Wow, that's so cool. So, uh, the dodge does actually have unique animations as well. If you dodge and, like, do a something while locked on, uh, the dodge out of attack. Oops, my bad. You have you have out of dodge attacks, just like just like the Souls games, you know. That's pretty great. Yeah, is that that's great, cool. Dim Ergo Fragment. Let's actually look at our list. Jesus, dude, the presentation. What the fuck? You can actually have builds. Vigor, Vitality, Capacity, mo Motivity. Holy shit, man. This game might be the real fucking deal. Holy hell. Amulet. Uh. Defensive parts. Workshop union leather. Let's go to usables. Uh, a fragment of ergo. Oh, okay. So, like, shards. Gotcha. Or, um, you know, souls. Throwing object. Uh, the grinder repairs weapon durability. When durability is a low, attack decreases. When durability falls to zero, the weapon will be destroyed. It cannot be repaired. Um, thus it is advice to keep an eye on the durability gauge. Toss into battle, the grinder is their lifeline. The sharpness of their blade can mean life or death. So that has limited uses, or no? Catalyst minus open abilities. Probably charges Fable.
That's pretty cool. Dude, this shit is this shit is dope. This shit is dope. Okay. That's a limited time buff. I essentially have to wait for it to to recharge. Uh, there are doors and ladders throughout Krat that are locked by devices. You can unlock the doors or go down ladders to create shortcuts. Nah, of cut because of course. Cool animations for doors opening. Very important. Right? Yo, what? Okay, it's time to die. Oh my god. Oh my god. Time to die. Time to die. Oh shit. Super sick. Dude, all the enemies look great. My god, man. Enemies look great. Combat feels interesting. Like, slightly, obviously, carries a lot of cadence and is very similar to Bloodborne, but holy hell. And we're back. Fucking around. We're fucking around. What did my shortcut unlock? There it was. Hey, buddy, how's it going? Nice being able to charge up the attacks, change them up. wants me to parry it feels like oh god oh that's right even if i'm blocking i'm losing health okay 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 all right all right all right all right all right, all right. uh interesting so blocking was taking like chip damage a little bit and if i unless i feel like i have to perfect block yeah the dodge feels very shallow you know Perfect does negate it, yeah. Neat. Dope. Oh, and you can recover chip damage by attacking back, so it truly is Bloodborne. You guys gonna come through this door? You are. Ow. Okay. Okay. God damn it. Okay. Wrong button.
Ow, man. Woo! Well, that guy was tough. Fuck. Fuck. He went spinning. All right. That was a, a, a perfect amount of challenge for the beginning of the game, you know? So, what am I missing here? Uh, LB plus Y gets some sort of blue stuff. And then... I can do this now. Okay. When the white life bar flashes white, you can do an R2 to get a finisher. Oh, oh, when their life bar. All right, all right, all right. Cool. Cool. I am very low on health. Currently. Oh, God. Where's my door at? Holy shit, ass! Oh my god, they were pissed! Oh god, they were pissed! Motherfuckers hunted me down. They smelled blood. Yeah, this feels great. RT for charged attacks. Ooh, okay. I missed that, that second one. I didn't mean to skip it. Get my stuff back. So dope. Yeah, I'm really digging this. I'm trying to find this goddamn door. Oh, it was back at the start, I think. Okay. I haven't been able to use my left arm too much. Cool. I wonder what the left arm is good for. What's that a mega punch? Poise, really. Damn, this is great. Holy shit, this game is great. Holy shit. Holy shit, this game is great. <laughs> Wishing upon a star. You star gaze. So fully recover HP and stamina as well as your pulse cells. Cool. This Can you is called a stargazer. Also level up. A marvelous device the stalkers used in the past. As we are, we are not strong enough to beat the puppets. But if I lend my power to this stargazer for a moment, gather ergo, clever one. This stargazer will make you stronger. 
But the Stargazer's strength doesn't last forever, so be careful with it. Hurry up and come to Hotel Krat. There we go. There we go. Uh, Vit goes up. We also get physical damage reduction. Vigor goes up, which is stamina. Capacity goes up, which is weight. And Legion, which I don't know what the hell that is. Uh, physical attack for motivity. All right. Technique also raises physical attack, but in different ways, I guess. Advance. Raises Legion. Uh, interesting. Legion's like the arm. Man, builds and shit, you know? What better way to level up than just to cram it into damage? Cram it into damage. Dead horse, definitely bloodborne. There's carriages, there's a dead horse, it's definitely bloodborne. Guard right before beginning hit. Shit. Is that a robot dog? Holy hell. Dope. Hey man, I need to test this out. This is great, dude. This shit is great. I'm having a great fucking time with this shit. This guy literally has the attacks of the fucking villagers at the beginning of Bloodborne. No, go away! This town's finished! He literally has like that shit. He's got the same fucking attack. Oh why? Oh why? <laughs> you plague ridden rat! Rat times. Uh lore. It's running fantastic as well. Like, we're at native 4K, solid 60, no drops anywhere, it feels like. You play. Ooh, let's get this guy. Walk up on him. And this animation is badass. Like. Fuck me, dude. So cool. So cool. God. The lock-on feels quite good, too. Ow. I actually quite like how snappy the lock-on is. The camera? So they, like, straight copied Bloodborne camera, it feels like. I mean, obviously. And it feels quite nice. I don't know how the hell to use my blue shit yet. We'll figure it out. Why? What the fuck? Oh shit, okay. All right. Damn, the enemy animations are also wonderful. So sick. Sorry, I'm I'm kind of gushing right now. Kind of gushing with this fucking game, dude. And there's plunging. Okay. Yeah, the blue bar comes back just from fighting. You get, like, super meter for just hitting opponents and stuff. Holy God. 
Nice. Okay. Cool. Cool. Liking everything I'm seeing so far. Dude, the atmosphere is on fucking point, too. Holy hell. Holy shit, man. Level design feels nice so far, too. I'm just going. You know? Okay. Uh, oh, okay, so here they are. Use Fable Arts while guarding. Use Handle Fable Arts. Weapons have distinct blades and handles that each have their own art. Fable Arts use a Fable Slots and different Fable Arts use a different number of slots. Charge Fable Arts by attacking enemies with weapons. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. RT. Come on, man. Damn, boy! God damn, that's sick. That's sick. Okay. So, specific enemies get their own, like, viscerals. You get these unique visceral attacks on these giant moments. Perfect block will make the enemies more groggy. Really? Where am I? Hey, stop it. This bitch has no head. Attack enemies' weapon to charge your pulse cells. Attack enemies with a weapon to charge your... Oh, that's just the stuff we've already known. Yeah, we knew that. Lots of wind-up on you, man. I guess this is just a damage buff. I'm already liking the level design. I'm getting lost, you know? Hey, and I found that thing I was looking at earlier. Cool. Urgent repair tool. What does that do? Instantly repairs weapon durability. Emergency repair tool. Uh, okay. Okay. Dude, this is so much like opening Yarnum. My god, man. I just, I got, especially with this, right? This is so much opening Yarnum. Like, they really. I think I felt it as soon as I went down here. All blocked off. Nice, let's go. I really let you know if you, uh, there's like a big glowing thing. Hey, that was the way I didn't go before. Nice. We just naturally have figured this out. Very nice. 
The thing is, it has its own identity. It, like, it obviously takes a lot of the things that Bloodborne does well without just directly copying all of it. But you appreciate. It's like, oh, we're gonna do- we're gonna put our own spin on it, right? There's been a billion Souls likes, and all of them have been, like, really different than Souls games. So please, be careful. Are you...? I knew that thing was gonna fucking hit me. Oh my god. Go right before getting hit. Oh, this is amazing. This is amazing. Teaching me shit. I'm being taught stuff. I'm being taught stuff. Hello? Hello there. Welcome to Karat, visitor. I didn't think there were any stalkers left to fight the puppets. You didn't hear? Figures. The whole organization fell apart. All that's left are wannabes and amateurs who think they can fight on their own. You ought to buy something while you're at the festival. You can't rely on yourself alone. Out here alone? You could use some help. Here's a festival gift for you. Ah. Now get yourself something useful. A rapier. A fate blade. That's what I had before. Electric blitz. Throwables. Usable items. These are just, uh, the same weapons. Yeah, the other starting weapons from before. I'll wait for now. Fuck, this looks great. This looks great. Holy shit. It's nice to see that, like, it doesn't have the absolute art pedigree of... a Souls, but it really looks great. Like, this is... up there. Raid Master likes singing and marching with people. Oh, these are going to be bosses, right? They're like teasing me with bosses and some shit. Probably the developer was unknown. They won't be after this. Uh oh. Boss looks amazing. Jesus, look at his hair and shit, buddy. Ow. Fucking face.
Oh my god, it's in Korean. Or some language. I didn't get a chance to really see! No, I don't know if that's Korean. Holy shit. He ripped off his own fucking head. All right. Cool. It's English, but it's distorted. Oh, oh, okay, okay. It just looked like an Asian language for a second. I'm like, I don't have time to look at that shit, man. You die in a boss battle, death ergo is created at the entrance of the boss area. Thank you for that. Uh, now we just have to figure out where to go. Gentlemen, excuse me, I have places to be. Is this? Oh, they've dropped Ergo? Shit. This is bad. Hey, fuck you guys. About to die. Ah, shit, I got souls. Fuck. I got souls, man. Take advantage or take for granted, you know, minor enemies and they'll just whoop your ass. We'll just whoop your ass. Fair enough. Fair enough. I thought that was the way we had to go. So, let's equip some of these equipables. Throw like thermite. Hell of these cogs. These probably are. Yeah, I was about to say these are rocks. And this gives me a uh, super meter. Okay. Okay. Uh, because I haven't not used one yet. Let's use one. Oh, no animation for it. Okay. Cool. Oh, you don't completely lose your souls when you die? Really? Physical damage reduction, but it's heavy. Oh, that's the only thing that goes in there. Okay. Uh, all right. It's hard to read this. Wait a minute. Better. It's just better. All right. Let's figure out where the heck that door was. Over here. Wait. This is my soul's... Whack. Point zero zero three poison resistance. Cool. Yeah, sawtooth wield are like, um, rocks. Shit. Where's our circus? There it is. Oh, wow. Cool. Fuck. Oh. 
God damn, boy. Wow, that still hit me? Ow, man. up attack okay i don't know where he's attacking from shit oh no big shit big shit i should probably use all my my souls and the shit that i dropped on the ground uh to level up or something so yeah i think i was parrying a lot of attacks there and I missed an opportunity to do crazy damage. You know? I, I think he flashed white for a second. And I could... Uh, charge R2? Or was that like a phase thing? That was the second phase. Okay, okay. Yeah, during the transition I could have done like... It was, uh... Charged R2? Okay, so when he changes phases, there's like a, a weakness spot. Cool. You get a lot of stamina too. Right, I keep feeling like I'm gonna run out of stamina or some shit, but... No, you seemingly get quite a bit. Shit. Yeah, stamina seems pretty generous. Now yeah, we're getting a lot of this. Okay, let's do it again. It's fun. Ow. Dumb fuck. This is so sick. That's not cool. This, this game is fucking awesome, bro. Holy crap. Okay. This is going poorly. Very 
Barry. Fuck, man, that delay. What is this, Elden Ring attack? Oh, shit! Oh, shit! All right. All right, all right, all right. I love it. I'm loving it, dude. The fact that they put these huge, like, counter animations for the bosses is so sick. So if you essentially, like, break the will of the bosses and then parry them like crazy, uh, you get an, a nutty-ass, like, visceral animation. Some enemies become red and use strong attacks called the Fury. You can't dodge or guard Fury attacks, which you can counter with a perfect guard. You can't dodge? <laughs> what? You can't dodge? What? Okay, so it's put up or shut up mode. You can only perfect parry. What is better, this or Bloodborne? This essentially makes Bloodborne look like wet shit, right? Like we thought Bloodborne was good. It, it's a game that is just wet shit. It's useless. Like if you've ever played Bloodborne, eliminate it from your memory. If you've ever liked Bloodborne, you should feel bad about yourself. Like, it makes Bloodborne look like amateur baby wet shit. Can't believe it. Can't believe I hate Bloodborne now. Can't believe it. What a shitty game. High praise. <laughs> Interesting animation. What the heck was that? Fuck me, dude, it's so sick. Piece of shit. That's right. That follow up. God damn, man, is this shit fun? God damn. Yeah, what was that sliding animation? What did I do? Um, I really can't. I, I, I don't have enough health to fuck around with the first form, you know? Do I need to sharpen? Really? Oh, was my shit actually getting fucked up from sharpening? I'm not paying attention to that as at all. Recovery dodge, yeah. Okay. Keep it sharp. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, does this game really come out the same day as Mortal Kombat? You have to be fucking shitting me, bro. I know a weapon can break, but, you know, we're fine. Oh no. Oh no, it's good. Right? It's like, oh no, it's good. I love that you can walk around while doing this. Alright, I'll try to pay attention to that. This is so much fun, dude. Oh my god.
Okay, this is bad. I'm gonna fucking run, dude. Oh no. Blocked. Okay, you're gonna let me out. You're gonna let me out. Ooh, I got it out. I got out. I got out. I got out. I got out. Okay. You piece of shit. You piece of shit. Hold on to this for me. Hang on to this for me, too. Yeah, you deserve it. Okay. So here's how we know. Here's how we know this game is legit. The bosses are dope. Right? We we know. This game is this game is not bullshit. No, dude, the bosses are fucking sick. Game's legit. Like, usually in, in the Souls likes, the bosses fall apart, right? Usually in all the Souls likes, the bosses are just like, oh, yeah, they're okay, but then they just kind of die and they're not that challenging. They don't, they don't give you that feeling. Fuck. Made it to the hotel. Fuck, man. That's just the first boss. So visually it had very much a, you know, cleric beast visual element to it, which is all like the loose hair, right? Uh, yeah, dude. Oh my God, that's right, I have to sharpen. Fuck, man. Fuck, this game is going to be good. And the level design is actually not total shite. That's... That's usually like one of the other telltale signs, is that the level design's just not good. It's like, okay, but it's not amazing. The greatest luxury level experience. Get yourself a treat of an unforgettable day. A lot of corridors, don't you mean like Yarnum? That's all fucking Yarnum is. Hotel security excludes puppets like you. So you'll have to lie to get inside. You're a special puppet after all. I need I didn't even use my arm attack during that shit. Shit. We need to lie. Here comes the other gimmick. Damn. Did Wukong have good levels and bosses? Wukong had pretty good bosses. Levels, not so much. The levels were just typical Neo bullshit. Combat was great. Combat in, in all of the Team Ninja Souls likes is amazing. Um, however, level design is uh, rough. Did I not say Wola? I said Wukong. Who are you? Grand Covenant's fourth floor. A puppet cannot lie. Welcome to Hotel Krat. Becoming human. So sick, dude. So sick. 
so fucking cool. Was that it? Oh, man. Is that the end? No, it's actually not the end. <laughs> There's even more. I'm down. I'm down. I'm not ready to be done. <laughs> nope. Dude, this game is wonderful. Holy shit. This shit. I can't even believe we just got done playing Final Fantasy 16 and this, and they're both wonderful. Too many good games. I'm so happy to see you. I am Sophia. I've been waiting for you. Searched all over the city of Croft to find you. You must have questions. Geppetto will have answers, but we have to find him first. He was last seen on Elysian Boulevard. All of Krat is dangerous for humans, and that neighborhood is one of the scariest. Please find Geppetto on Elysian Boulevard. I'll explain more once you find him. Wait, take this pocket watch. Krat is a labyrinth of peril right now. This watch will guide you to a safe place. Be careful, clever one. A pocket watch imbued with mystical power. Power of the watch turns back time when the boy was in peak condition. What? Teleport to hotel or last stargazer used. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Gotcha. Look at Gemini. I think he's in shock. Jesus. That's proof you're broken. The real Gemini isn't so calm. I'm no inventor, but perhaps I can fix him. Or perhaps he'll fix himself in time. I'll use my power to help you. Cool. Cool. Uh... Goes up three. Goes up five for my legion arm. I'm thinking, uh, motivity is pretty much strength, right? Physical attack on my weapon is going up. That's good. Yeah. Let's do that. Ergo is the miracle that made Krat prosper. Without Ergo, there would be no automated puppets to make Krat wealthy. When you move, you tap into the power of Ergo within you. Gather more Ergo. It will make you stronger. In the folklore of Krat, a cricket often acts as a guide. That is why these automated models became popular. But Gemini is unique. He's more than just a guide. As you get more familiar with Gemini, you'll see what I mean. There's a lot of really cool things in here, like instead of Jiminy, his name is essentially Gemini, but pronounced differently. A lot of really cool ideas in here. I mean, but just granted, like, the, the fact that you're like uh, uh, an automaton looking for his creator 
uh, to be a, to become a real boy type shit is just like, wow, that's such a cool fucking idea for a Souls game. Welcome to Hotel Croc. I, I think I was immediately sold on this game, like in the first Thank trailer, just even knowing what it is. Lady Antonia. Please let me know how I may be of service. At Hotel Crot, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Welcome to Hotel Crot. How may I be of service? Rapidly charging Legion, okay. Dude, yeah, somebody just mentioned it. How fucking amazing would it be if this game pops off for these devs? And in the future, they take on other folklore tales and stories. Can you fucking imagine an Alice in Wonderland Souls-like? Can you fucking imagine Alice in a Souls-like, dude? Like, holy shit, if this shit popped off, like, I'm completely- I'm in. Holy shit, I'm in. That sounds amazing. Hansel and Gretel, like, all this wild and shit. Their take on it. Unexpected guests are welcome. We don't insist on reservations. I am Antonia. And this is my hotel. Welcome. Oh, I knew from the moment we met the George Petto's puppet. He did have a few loose screws, but Geppetto's skills are undiminished. It's a shame. He took off for Elysian Boulevard, and he never came back. It's art, though. If it doesn't turn up soon, we'll have to make a new coffin. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I was keeping this for him. It comes with a long story. But I think it's better off with you. Please find that old man. And do take care of yourself out there. Was that an emote? Did I just get some drip? Costume. Someone's memory. There's accessories that go on the face and shit? Huh. They're here just for... fashion. They're exclusively for fashion. They don't have any stats. The uniform of a sophisticated and dignified boarding school. The clothes must have been worn before. The uniform of a boarding school famous in Krod. The initial M is engraved on the elegant brooch. Huh. Thought I talked to her. Drip of M. Um... What is the... Does anyone know what the gesture button is? Uh... Does anyone know what the, the actual command is? Hold A. Oh, you would like equip it? What the hell? Oh. Yes. Oh, forgive me, I'm rambling. When you get to my age, your memories are like good friends. And just as distracting. <laughs> so... Is there possibly like a hidden insight system in this game? Maybe. Your springs are reacting, so it's like you developing emotions as a robot? 
Interesting. That's fucking cool, dude. This game is fucking cool. And it looks great. Holy shit. Yeah, not to mention, like, just visually, it looks awesome. Oh, I didn't want to use that crap. So they were just like, yeah, we just want to add all the Sekiro stuff too, you know? All the stuff that's in Sekiro. We want to put all of it in here, you know? All the perfect parry, the posture stuff, all that shit is still in here. The poise element of like... Interesting. I can actually level up my, uh, my blue shit on this guy. Just for testing. So sick. So sick. The animations are fucking sick, dude. Okay. I'm guessing this is where we want to go. There's a blacksmith's lady somewhere? Yeah, we haven't even investigated this whole place. Let me look around. Neat. It's locked tight. Yeah, this game feels, instead of like it's ripping off Bloodborne, it feels like it's a love letter to it. You know? Feels like a love letter to Bloodborne. Oh, I do have a jump. Wow. Cool. Thank you. I've not found the resident, uh, craftswoman. Oh, there's shit down here. Until Krat is one of the city's creepiest and most mysterious buildings. According to Laura, Krat is an isolated castle built by an aristocrat devoted to the form of occultism after receiving a revelation from a radiant tree. At one point, it was used as a mental institution, and some patients say they see hallucinations. However, no records remain as they were all destroyed in a large fire. Above all, being so far underground just compounds the rumors. Some even say that it's connected to an unknown hell. But now the rumors have served to embellish the charm of Hotel Krat, which has now renovated in the latest style. As the recent rumors of the Grand Exhibition Ghost Hotel spread, more customers are actually looking to stay at the hotel. Next is the commitment from the hotel owner, Miss Antonia, a ghost hotel. I've heard that more times than I can remember, but fortunately our hotel guests are brave like lions. It's not a problem at all. Four out of five. Creepy and mystical. Best resort in Krat. Uh, the guide was made with the support of Ve Venigi Company. A uh, friend of the city. I'm really digging the fucking lore, too. <laughs> right? It's a Yelp review. I'm actually really digging the lore. Uh, where is our... Slady. You You're here? here to see Master Geppetto, right? Come this way. 
I heard about you from Geppetto, but oh. to see you in person. I missed you. Wow. Completely missed you. You were over here. This. Geppetto left it with me. So they knew that. Too many people were skipping this NPC. Uh oh. I got new tech. The puppet string. Legion arm is a special equipment that is equipped on the left arm. Each legion arm has its own combat ability. Arm can be modified into all sorts of forms. Modifications can be made using Venigi craft machine. Uh, what is it? Uh, Venigni? Can't even pronounce that. So, puppet string? Can't use it in here. Devilbringer? The sound of it alone. That craftsmanship comes only from the hands of Geppetto. Venini, yeah. You must be something else. A custom arm from Geppetto himself is quite an accessory. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I am Eugenie from the Workshop Union. I know my way around weapons of all kinds. I'm sure Master Geppetto would agree. If any of your weapons need work, bring them to me. I know my way around a weapon. Alter handle. You can bring Eugenie cranks to alter. Oh, that's what those are for. Each handle's property upgrades based on your character's basic stats. You can change this property and, and, and grade one time with each handle alteration. However, you can also reset it with the balanced crank. Wow, shit, dude. There's a lot of stuff to this. Wow, so you can add stats to your handles. Um, yeah, why not? Let's rank it up. Yeah. Make it easy on myself for now. Need more moonstones. Probably come from bosses. All right. This is going to be a hidden gem of 2023? No, I have a very good feeling this game is going to do super fucking well. I mean, granted, it's a Game Pass game already. But this is one of those games that'll get, like, really good word of mouth. And we'll end up doing super good. Great fortune to all visitors. Rest for all travelers. Blessings to all friends. I think this game is going to do super good. It feels insanely polished. That's what's kind of crazy about it. It's really... It's really polished. Kind of mind-blowingly polished. Oh man. Well, that looks like it's gonna be fun. Does that recharge? Let's be more careful. Ah, the Black Rabbit Brotherhood. I hate these guys. But don't be alarmed. My name is Gemini. We'll talk later when we're safe. This shit is too cool. Game is too cool. And now we get a lot of verticality in in this second part of the level. Hmm. 
This shit is neat. Uh, so, uh, chat, genuine question. How does my, uh, my yellow stuff at the bottom left, how does that work? How does it recover? You have to actually use an item to get it back. So, I think we had that. Um... At the Stargazer. Consumable or Stargazer can refill it. Okay. Yeah, I saw it at the shop. I didn't have any. That's right. I, I didn't buy it. Okay, cool. Yeah. Dope. Man, they really made these impacts feel wonderful. It's wonderful. Elysian Boulevard was a regular rich people row. You wanted fancy boutiques and shops. <laughs> no place better. Oh, there's a bunch of dead horses all over the place. Ago, before the puppet frenzy. Clearly a uh yeah. Cool. Man, I'm kind of just blown away. Oh shit. Bad. Oh, fuck you, man. So... Accessory? Gotcha, up 2.4. Uh, cannot be changed here, so I have to sw swap that out back in other places. Okay. Up we go. Like I'm gonna be ambushed. Very familiar animation there. Shit! My expert dodge. Cut, please. And healing is very sparse. Right? I mean, it's a Souls game. So I get it. But goddamn, healing is very sparse. Yeah, we're in the era of these action games providing the most incredible demos. Like FF4... I'm sorry, FF16's demo. And this just have... Insane demos. How's it going?
What'd you drop? Star fragment. Cross dimensions to grant human wishes? What in the hell? Star fragment? Uh, parade leader's ergo. Oh, I just realized that... Packed with immense power, a treasure hunter want, might want this rare ergo, although... A treasure hunter may want this ergo. Okay, so this is used for a side quest at some point, because it's a boss soul. Okay. Um, yo, where the hell did our star fragment go? Ergo fragment? Leader fragment? Or a boss weapon, potentially? Yeah, 5k for the demo. So yeah, because assuming that it's not in here. Um, that was a crafting item? What the shit? It is. No, wait, that's not it. It's this. Meteor fragment that can be found in different parts of the crot. It can be used at the cracks calling in front of a boss area to summon a specter. Star fragments cross dimensions to grant human wishes. If you wish for it desperately enough, there may be able to summon someone who wants to help save this world. Wishing upon a star. And it's somebody that helps you out. Fucking cool. Fucking cool. Potentially a co-op kind of item. This game is awesome. Holy shit. I see that guy. <laughs> I am fucking loving this game. I'm loving. It. Oh shit, I don't love this. Oh my god. Item. Not ignoring it. Nice. Not nice. Hey. Okay. This off. Shit. This is bad. Oh my god. I went the wrong way there, dude. <sighs> nice throw, idiot. <laughs> Wasn't ready for that. All the way back here. God damn. Never got a shortcut, did I? No, no, no. I unlocked uh, a ladder. I did get a shortcut. Well, bye. What if that big boss dude comes back? Nice. All right, cool game. Cool. So there is large enemies that you you permanently take out. Dope game. I like it. Completely down with that shit. Yeah, mini boss enemies are actually bosses. They do not return. Seems about right. No super annoying game design, you know? Yeah, I just raised the brightness of the game a bit.
Back step seems great. Ow. Oh, really? What is that? Nice. So, um, uh, lightning paper. Also a ladder that I just missed before. Sharp pipe. What? Sharp pipe. Throwing object. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Yeah, level design's wonderful. At least so far, it's wonderful. Prison shank. Doggo. Want to save. Oh, this is bad. Shit. I missed? That sucks. Anything in the combat, I'm fucking loving it. It's like a little bit of a little bit of Bloodborne, a little bit of Sekiro, a little bit of Dark Souls. All fun. I don't really know what to make of the durability mechanic yet. I don't know. But I love that animation, so that helps a lot. Charlotte, my treasure, I can't do anything. I think the streets are nothing, are already dead, nothing but silence. I assume that I too will become just another petrified corpse. Still remember the sound of your singing voice, the sight of Charlotte looking at the picture books. I miss all of it. The best thing I did was when I was alive to send you and Charlotte to the cathedral for shelter. Oh, wish this nightmare was all over. If only you and the kid could come back, but I guess now it's impossible. I love you. I pray that you're safe. And you get emotes from that. Ooh, chest. Oh, dear. Oh, fuck you. Oh, my God. You got me. Somebody give that guy a raise. You got me. Damn, that's a good one. Fuck. That was a good one, too. See, the reason why that's a good trap is because I thought the threat was the big enemy in front of me. That's a good one. And that isn't just a bullshit jump scare. Uh, it was a true deviation of my attention. I thought the- I thought what was 
the what was the the actual issue was the enemy in front of me. Ah, oh, that's a good one. Now uh, you guys get it, right? These guys fucking get it. Yeah, these guys get it. Where was that other? Is it over here? Uh, I got bamboozled too. There was another ladder that I think I dropped. Somewhere. It might just be the one. Chase my dogs. I am. Yeah, I saw a ladder I wanted to go down, but I'm assuming we could go up. Maybe not. Now I'm, I'm getting shot now. Fuck. Let me do this. Let me stargaze and then... Damn, this UI here. So sick. Cool. More star fragments. Pretty cool. Alright, I just wanted to use it a little bit. Yeah, mad plus frames on this grapple. Just go up. So we'll check on that other ladder. I thought it was... Uh, something else. It's bad. It's fucking bad. Boys. Oh my god, boys. Boys, boys. Okay, not dead, not dead. All good. Oh, this is a different... Oh! Oh shit. You have to take this from me, aren't you? Get that fucking candelabra out of here, man. Hidden moonstone. Uh, crafting item? And there is our shortcut. You dickhead. I'll go pop this again and we'll go on a righteous adventure.
Uh oh. Oh god. Am I about to be ambushed by like 12 fucking dudes? I am. Please stop. Alright. Up we go. Yeah, how's it going? Oh shit, man. Bullets hurt. All right, fuck. Use this. That's right. That really stunned the sh Oh my god. My healing though. There's something I'm missing with this dog. Right? How's it going? Put that down, please. Ow! Another one! Damn Souls games. There is our big boy. Yeah, there, there, I think there's a reason why the uh, the dodge isn't as good as it is, is because they're encouraging this. I get it. I actually, I think I get it. They're trying to encourage this stuff, right? The step dodge when locked on is full invul. So you mean like, like this? That? Not this, or this. Oh. Oh, you're telling me these are full invulnerability? All of these are full invulnerability? That seems pretty good. down. Life amulet. I don't think I've gotten an amulet yet. No. Kept on a puppet information memories used for most of impress them simple and trial special powers. The slightest blink is enough to make puppet move. Puppets don't have life, but it is enough to move them. Increases your max HP. Is that actually reflected on the fucking character? No, I don't think so. I don't think so.
Was it really on the chest? That's neat. Ooh, a stargazer. Hell yeah. Hell yes. You can level up too. Uh, are you? You are. Finally, someone is talking to me. I'm Jiminy, your friendly puppet guide. Or friendly guide puppet? I don't know, one of those. I'm also a friend of Sophia's. Last time I woke up, Sophia was there because... Because she woke me up. But I'm sure there are still other memories in there. Sorry. Must be the shock. Bear with me, and I'll do my best to guide you. You can transfer from one Stargazer to another. You can only travel to those you've activated. Stargazer's in an area that's been marked with a hint. Rat. Uh, Boulevard. Inside the house. On. Isium Boulevard. Oh. We go practice, we go back to Hotel Krat. Okay. And from Hotel Krat, I can level up. Cool. Cool. I am loving this shit, bruh. I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. It's so much fun. It's such a goddamn video game, too. It's great. I'll use my power to help you. Uh, Legion, wait. This is all fairly fine at the moment. Yeah, I think this is easily the best Souls-like of all of them. Destroy. Why would you want to destroy? Where's that boss soul? Ooh, weapon upgrade to three. I know my way around. Ah, I need another moonstone. Shit. Oh, that one has an animation because it looks awesome. Holy hell. Well, the big boys have animations. cooking. Oh my god, you're right, dude. The loading bar at the bottom is your nose. That's fucking awesome. It's your nose, and it grows as it's loading. That's fucking so good. So good. Oh, hello. You again. Why, hello! <laughs> I didn't know anyone was alive out here. I know what you're thinking, but I'm not a burglar. <laughs> I'm just crashing in an abandoned house for a while. Don't worry, I won't cause any trouble. We survivors need to look out for each other. Uh, for your information, I didn't steal this. Electric coil stick handle. Oh shit. New weapon. And it's a 
head and handle geared blunt damage can disassemble yeah it does lightning damage do I have anything that I can damn it, I just popped so many souls I literally need to whack something right I literally just need to whack something I'll come right back I want to see what that is what now I knew it. I fucking knew it. God damn, I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. Give me that thing. Let's see what it is. I fucking knew it. These chimney sweep bastards. Uh, bring her in for me. Oh, so we don't have to be beholden to one or the other. Nice, and the weapons are where they should be. Dude. Sick. Has the same kind of move set, right? My weight, though? Oh, it hasn't, it hasn't changed my, my jumping. You know? I'm slightly heavy, but whatever. That is 10 weight. Slightly heavy. Weight just changes stamina. Oh, stamina regen. That yeah, seems fine. I'll live. I've lived with worse. Interesting. Ooh, durability is pretty low. Wait, I can sense something strange. Jeepers. Is that a butterfly? See the thing. What? Bye bye. Thought I bought this. I hear a cat. I've been hearing a dog. Oh shit! That guy looks like he's a problem. We're gonna want to go down there, but first, wait. Let's make sure I'm not about to get shot or stabbed. Already is challenging. Dim fragment, seriously? That's it. Yeah. Butterfly? B butterfly? What the? Huh? What the hell? <laughs> Fucking hit it? Occasionally, a dimensional butterfly will appear. Monad's lamb can detect butterfly and lights up red to the point of its location. When the character is near the hiding butterfly, it will appear. After a certain amount of time, the butterfly will disappear. Wow, that's the loot goblin. Kill it to get useful materials. Sick. They gave me a moonstone for leveling up. Sick. Uh, we have to go back to that place back there with the ladder. Oh, wait, what? Oh. 
This must be your first time in the petrification disease quarantine zone. For most people, this is their last stop. You are a good Samaritan for coming all the way here. I won. May I ask you a favor? My family took my baby from me and sent me here. They said it was for my own good, but it was heartless just the same. A baby must be with its mother. Please go to Quart City Hall and bring me my baby. Please go to Quart City Hall and bring me my baby. Thank you so much, kind one. I can finally see my sweet Elena's face again. Please hurry. Heart scales spreading across my eyes. Before I lose my sight, please. She said the baby was at City Hall. Should we check it out? I hope everybody's safe. Yes, ma'am. Will do. Oh, fuck. Fuck you, man. Fucking shit. Fucking bullshit. Fucking bullshit, man. Crap. Big crap. This guy's chip damaging the hell out of me. Um. Alright. Where are we at? Uh, when you reach weight limit, it greatly shows down your movement. Upgrade your capacity to increase the weight limit. These are nice tips, right? These are actually good tips. I appreciate these tips. More your bullshit either. The game called me fat, but I appreciate it. Damn it. That actually used it, too, you son of a bitch. I think this game is so cool. Oh fuck, that's not cool. What the dumb fuck is happening? What the fucking dumb fuck? Ow.
Jesus, we're beating the shit out of everything. So what? Uh, these are like traps. Drop something over here. This guy really got up and chased my ass down. Okay. What? Installation converter? Equipable? It is. Holy moly. Now I'm a heavy boy. Okay. Back to normal. Now let's go back over here really quick and see. Can I take, like, the hilt of this and mix and match with the thing of that? No. I don't know. Yes. Later. Maybe not currently. on health but I I think we might have just come across a shortcut or a boss the shortcut this is the door ah shit wrong side of the door Oh, the health actually comes back. Interesting. Wait, did that door... Heals do recharge when you damage enemies? Really? Wow, so the more you fight, the more of a chance you have to get your health back. Shit. It's only ever the last heal, though. Well, that's nice. That makes sense. Good idea. Yeah, I see it recharging over there. Okay. So that's what all that pink stuff is. <laughs> Fucking shit. I was about to be very angry. Fucking star fragment, dude. Hang on a second. We have to see. Right? Oh, I can't use it here. Um... You have to use it in front of a boss area. Okay, okay, okay. In front of a boss area. 
Yeah, these guys get it. Right? This is probably like the best Souls-like level design of any of them. Level design in this feels quite good. I'm out of healing. Feels great. Such a great like advent. Oh, oh shit. You know, it feels like we're really adventuring through these levels. What the hell? Okay, we went over here last time. What did we eventually die to? Oh. That guy. Alright. I think we can go back and use the Stargazer. It's like right over here. You know? We went down there, we did all that shit. Just hooks around. It could... The, the pocket watch doesn't, um... Does the pocket watch take away any resources? Or is it just free? It doesn't, really. Uh, I don't think I have enough to mess around. Stargazer, wait a minute. Switch Legion? We can go back to the big punchy arm. Less weight. More physical. This one's better for gimmicks. No one else. Uh, it can be strong around an enemy to drag them towards you or move you towards them. Alright. Yeah. Punchy thing is interesting, though. I do like punchy arm. Ew. Punchy is unlimited. Yeah. That's what's nice about it. Yeah, I only got a thousand echoes on me right now. Let's just run. I'm missing something with this cat barking at me over here. Oh, I didn't even click this. Petrification disease quarantine zone. No trespassers. Oh, fucking shit. Good luck with this, guys. That's what I thought. Damn it, he saw me. All right, well, uh, here we go. That was bad. This bitch hurts. Oh, let's try this. Well, that sucks. Dude. What the fuck is up with this guy? He's so- he hurts so much. Oh my god, and he's fast as shit. We need the shortcut. The fuck is the shortcut? Oh my god. Oh god, oh god. Guys with broadswords and shit. Thank you! These fuckers with broadswords start coming out. Popo's on my ass. Holy shit. Ow. Oh, well, I got the goddamn door. At least I got the goddamn door. 
Is the game harder? No, no, it's super easy. Don't worry about it. Super easy. Got the shortcut. This elevator's still fucky. What do you think about that? Um, trying to think of where we might want to go. Yeah, we need to we need to kill this big guy. Right? We need to kill this big fat bastard. I want to see him die. Demo performance is great. Game looks great. Running great. Seems to be very good. Alright, so how the hell do we fight this bitch? Do we just eventually break his goddamn arm? Let's go. Busted his weapon. Fucked him up. Ugh, they're creepy. Krat police baton handle. Physical attack. A lot. Blunt type. Okay. Completely different move set. Weird. No range, but you beats the shit out of things. Weird. All right. Actually, fight some of the enemies around here now. But I can. Hey, you, come here. Jesus Christ! Ow! Like, ow! Hey, you too, come here. Oh, this thing is beefy as shit. Ow. Ow, fuck. Oh, fuck you. I hear something behind me. How's it going? Oh, shit. Jeez, the broadsword guys are something else. Hey, is this the elevator? Nice. Nice, you get that wonderful feeling? That souls-like feeling? Let's go. Let's go. That wonderful souls-like feeling. And the level design is actually good. Who'd have thought it? Damn, he got 
guys fucking hurt. You guys hoi. What are you doing over here? Version repair tool. Jeez, dude. Oh, that was this game. This demo is so big. Verge puppets. All puppets will be destroyed. Come out, Geppetto. You got a lot to answer for. Huh? You know what caused the puppet frenzy, don't you? You're their maker, practically their father. You and the alchemist scheming together. Tell me the truth. What's your problem? I'm here for the old man. Get lost. Wait. I know you. Or more like I know what you are. You're the devil's puppet. You can't sneak past me. Die! Oh shit. The music. Hey, man. Okay, this fucking bastard. Jesus, where the hell are your attacks at? This guy's a piece of shit. A real big piece of shit. This time it's destroyed Ooh. for sure. Oh. Oh. You know what? Probably using the blunt against this guy isn't good. I'm assuming that we got to do the other thing. He's got this really slow wind up. Yeah. Fast as fuck, boy. Yeah, we can always try to break his weapon. And all the birds and shit. You guys have to be fucking shitting me, right? Nice. Game is smart. You can't sneak past me. Die. You see his weapon. Right, you actually see his weapon breaking. Dude, come on. Dude, come on. Damn, dude. Broke your shit, bitch. I'll kill Broke you that both, shit. Then string you up on the bridge. Donkey. Let's go. That is so cool. Right? If you parry enemies enough, they lose like a huge part of their weapon.
Was dad in here? Seeing you like this, I understand why some people despise me. I invented the puppets after all. I should take responsibility as their maker. But in order for me to do that, I need to take care of the puppets at City Hall. Won't you help me, son? I thought that would be the end for sure. Holy crap, what the fuck? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. I want to hear all about your experiences. But now isn't a good time. Use the stalker's key to open the bridge door. Then get rid of the frenzied puppets that have seized City Hall. We'll catch up at Hotel Krat when you're done. Dude, I just got a lot of stuff. Like, a lot of stuff. Wow. 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 What other crazy shit did I get? A tool that can assemble and disassemble a weapon's blade and handle. Oh. Oh, so this allows me to mix and match now. Dope. This is actually the mixing and matching thing. Very cool. Damn, we're still in tutorial, you know? That was a fun boss, man. I- I just love it that you can break bosses... ...weapons? That's so sick. Dude, this demo is fucking massive, bro. You can bring the puppets near the boss and they will attack each other too. That's so sick. So about that weapon assembly tool you were talking about. If you find any more weapons, let's try using them here. Wait, here at the Stargazer? Nice. Assemble weapons through Eugene at the hotel or at the Stargazers. Separate your weapons into blade and handle and assemble them into new weapons that match your character's battle style. A weapon features are decided by the handle and the blade combo. Wait a minute. So, I could do... Handle is moveset, blade is damage. Electric coil stick plus crat police handle. Okay. Maybe I'm making a shock baton? Or am I thinking of it the wrong way? I'm gonna have to be the other way around? 
Oh, you can always undo it. Oh my god. Yeah, I just made a shock baton. Wow. This is very cool. Right? Like, this shit is super fucking cool. This game just keeps getting better and better. God damn, the game really just keeps getting better and better. I almost don't believe it. Each blade and handle have different blue meter abilities. Yeah, you're right. There's the other side, right? Yeah. Yeah, let's try the, uh, the club handle and saber blade. Maybe that'll make a really buff saber. Rush, smash, strike, chance. I didn't make it, damn it. My bad. Shit. Weird. Oh, these guys are like weak to back attacks. Okay. Ow. Ow, I'm about to be fucking fucked up. Funny. Yeah, I didn't get the great sword yet. I haven't found it. What about my other weapon? <sighs> Hell does this do? This can't be any good, right? can't be any good. Oh, the starter weapons, yeah. Fuck, that is not a good combination. Fast, but no range. Uh, the rapier and greatsword were the ones sold to the hotel. Oh, oh, I see. So the greatsword was technically one of the starting weapons. Okay. Gotcha. This feels like a shitty combination. Not nearly as exciting.
uh, disassemble. So, yeah, I like this new weapon. Try that. Rapier handle and the saber blade. Yeah, we haven't messed around with the rapier yet. It's just got even more range. Cool. Time the uh, the backstabs, right? That's doing a lot of damage too. Holy shit! Okay, let's move on. Cover away by equipping two weapons. Whatever. Slightly heavy. I'm fine, bruh. But okay. That sucks. You're turned around and you're a heavy boy. Sorry. What in the dumb shit? Huh? Dude, something burst out of its chest. Yo, what in the hell? Yeah, is that the plague that happens to the humans? The petrification thing? Ugh. Shit. Birds. Game is something else. What the fuck is that? Oh shit, it's one of these guys. That does a lot. Holy hell. Oh, no. No survivors here. What do we do? Just give her that baby puppet? Broken puppet covered in wounds. It was left in the city hall garden, a luxury item. The child of a rich family once played with. It is unknown where the puppet's owner is. Oh, shit. Damn, fool. Chill. 
Oh god. That sucks for you. God damn. Hey, come here. Ow. Ow. Okay. To go find her. I didn't think that lady was a puppet, but I guess she was. Ooh, big chest. The patient's amulet. Yo, what? Information and memories that are useful for keeping the springs in order to maintain composure and meaningful skills for puppets, even puppet designers. Increases stamina recovery speed. Well, that's godlike. That's godlike. Wonderful. Using a star fragment to crack next to the skull of Spectre. Ooh, okay, so we have a boss battle here, and now we know, right? And now we know. Okay. So. Let's go back to the lady and give her the thing. Weird. Yeah, she's just back through here. A little bit further back. What's better, this or Elden Ring? This game makes Elden Ring look like... Baby diaper doo-doo. Elden Ring should get deleted permanently because of this game. We should just erase all of our memories of it. Baby doo-doo diaper doo-doo. It makes it look so bad. It makes us look stupid. Ow, fuck! Oh shit! Oh no! Oh god, I'm lost. No, I'm not. Good. Found her. You found her. Guide one. I could sense her from miles away. My sweet Elena. Please let me hold her. Oh, there, there, my baby. I missed you so much. What do you think? Is my baby adorable? She's cute, baby. right kind one <laughs> you've granted me my only wish <laughs> my sweet Elena <gasps> we're going to be happy now <laughs> thank you so much kind one Please accept my heartfelt gratitude. Close your eyes, dance the night away with me, everything will feel better. Is that a feel? A feel amulet? How was that feel thing? Huh? It's a record player. The hotel plays it as a disc. How cool is that shit? How cool is that sh- Oh, you should probably talk to her again. That'd be a good idea.
Nope, oh, untalk toable. gentlemen. This game feels pretty amazing. Yeah, I got 5k souls on me. We're gonna have to go uh, expend those. I need to find... We got a stargazer right here. We got the shortcut. We're good. This is a healthy demo. Holy shit, man. This is a really, really good demo. And it's all good. It's not like I'm like, oh, it's still going. Like, no, man, it's fucking great. This game's gonna be something special. If the rest of the game is anywhere close to this quality, what the hell is this gonna be? This game's gonna be something special. Holy shit. This game's gonna be something fucking special. I don't know, man. I am getting really immersed into this shit. I am really digging this game. Um, okay. FF16 Eliza P. This game makes Final Fantasy 16 look like fucking doo doo baby doo doo diaper baby diapers. Fucking doo doo baby baby doo doos. It just doos. It's what it does. It makes everything look bad.
Is this back to like the front? I'm trying to remember. This takes us to like the beginning of level two. Does. This is the beginning of level two. There's our stargazer. All right, let's go find this boss. Do it. Let's do it. Let's go check it out. Should we summon for the boss? I'm tempted just to see what it's like. Because, um, hmm. I'm tempted just to see what the, if we wish upon a star, if it, how it works. I think we should just, maybe not the first time. I am debating. This shit is creepy. Yeah, it's kind of like, it's a demo, fuck it, you know? That's what I'm kind of feeling right now. It's a demo, fuck it. Cool animation. What is it? What does it do? Okay, well, let's go check out the boss. That's a big cop. And I have electric weapon, that's not good. Oh wow, I got somebody helping me. My saber is so powerful. Oh my god, that guy. Holy shit! Oh my god. My God. Oh God, ow, oh my God, ow, oh God. Please leave me alone. Please leave me alone. He's chasing me down!
Oh my god, that's right, you have to dodge it. Dude, holy god damn! Okay, I'm trying to parry here. Oh, oh, God. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Um, cool. This boss is great. So he's got to, like, you, you can't parry the... You, you're trying to, like, wait for the parry, but it's a command grab, so he, he fucking fakes you out. That's super cool. I couldn't tell which weapon was better. I think my, uh, my baton might have been better. Or the blade might have been better. Yeah, the mix-up was actually pretty sick. I wonder what we're going to break on him if we do break something. Oh. Let's try it without it. Shit ass. Didn't dodge that, I guess. Oh my god, no running. No running. Oh shit, no, no running. Oh shit! <laughs> no running. <laughs> Why are you running? Why? Um, yeah, let's try to, uh... What's it called? Flip our weapon a bit and we'll make a electric saber. Let's do that. So what would we want to do? Saber for the start, right? And electric coil stick handle. I feel like it's what we have. Did we, isn't that what we had before? Could we even do that? Uh, we already had that. That's what we were doing before. Yeah. So, let's try this. Yeah. Lose a bit of the, um, you know, slash and bonk. Yeah, let's try it. I'm going to save the other weapons for when the game comes out. Yeah, I'm kind of... I want to spoil myself on that. 
I now see why you want to purchase those things, though. Why that is good. More damage, less range. We're going to see how it works. Puppet string, I don't know what I want to use that for in this fight either. I wasn't using it at all. Fucking too late. a lot of damage. Cool wind-up attacks, man. This fucking boss is so sick. Ow. Not sick. Hey, I thought that was the command grab. Fuck. Me. Oh, Jesus. Got me with the stun. This didn't seem to do uh, as much damage, right? This, the other one, I, I feel like the other weapon I had, the longer one, seemed like it did more damage. And I'm doing way, it feels like I'm doing more damage as well because the summon isn't there. When the summon is there, it is way more health, just like Bloodborne. Saber handle plus police baton head. Really? Oops. Think combat's gonna get repetitive like Sekiro? Well, no, because, uh, you know, you have all these different fucking weapons and combinations and movesets to mess around with. Baton head and electric handle. This one's not upgraded though. These aren't upgraded either. Uh... We got a couple now. Yeah, we can mess around with this. We can try this one. See how good this shit is. Fuck. 
Fuck. Bitch. Ugh. Shit out of here. I want to be electrically shocked, please. Electrically shocked. That's probably going to cause paralysis and nutty shit. God damn. Oh, that was command grab. Oh God. It's your blue gauge. Oh shit. My durability oh god now i gotta sharpen oh fuck all right so there's a lot packing on here it to me it feels like the best combination was the the blade right it feels like the blade was the the best thing i could do Yeah, blade here and electric. This seemed like the best bet. Also, this does like nothing. Let's go with punchy arm. Big punchy arm. Oh, my left arm is actually got a charge to it. Okay. Increases brightness upon use. Uh, whatever the hell that was. We don't have it anymore. What else is down here that we can fucks with? Legion arm stuff. When used, it, it removes overheat, electric shock, decay, and contamination. Okay. Yeah. That'll be nice to have, right? That'll be nice to have. Yo, what's up, Tiff? God, I thought that was the command grab. Dude, that shit goes far as fuck, boy.
Holy shit. Fuck. Cheap. Oh, that's cheap. Just saw it. God damn it's cheap. Go. So sick, dude. So sick. Bosses are all hella satisfying, right? Bosses are crazy satisfying. So sick. The fact that you have like the Sekiro timing in there too to mess around with shit. Oh my god. just wonderful yeah so many options to whoop ass Whew, I think we're done here pal back to the hotel uh-oh. Uh-oh. Mike, does it actually keep going? At some point, I do have to go to sleep. Oh, it shows that who's actually at Hotel Crap. That's cool. This compares very well to Souls games. I, I think it's the closest to Souls games there has been of like any of them. You saved Geppetto. Wonderful. He is on the second floor. He can hardly wait to see you. Oh, this door is open now. Geppetto's workshop? Wow. Ah, you've returned. Forgive a sentimental father for worrying about his son. Always remember that you're precious to me. Even when I ask you to do something dangerous. Speaking of which, there's a factory just beyond the Lycian Boulevard. It's packed with countless puppets. My friend, the inventor Venini, went to stop them, but he never came back. 
Please, go save him and shut down the factory. Organs are the source of your powers. Collect quartz to get the strength you need. Remember, the hotel is the last safe place in Krat. It's our only refuge in a city full of perils. It'll be extremely dangerous if anyone has ill intentions. Be careful who you tell about this place, especially if they're stalkers or alchemists. Be wary of dangerous people, and always be a good boy to me. Ah, shit. What? Use P organ slot to activate your character's latent abilities. Quartz on P organ to obtain its corresponding effect. If you equip quartz in each of the slot in a single group, you can gain the group's synergy effect. Each time synergy effects of two groups are activated, the next step is unlocked. You can get a greater variety of effects to take your P organ to higher. Increase the number of charged fable slots, number of pulse cell. Oh my god, there's a goddamn full ass skill tree as well. Enables another dodge in the middle of a dodge mo Oh my fucking god. This shit is crazy, dude. There's so much to chew on in this game. Now we're done? Now you can get the arm meter refills on kills? Oh my god. Phase two must be active. Now we are done. Holy shit. So you don't only get the one thing, you get two other things that go with it. And the link is being made as, as we're seeing it here. Wow, and it uses the gems. Oh my god, charge legion when eliminating enemies one? Dude, this fucking game, man! Oh my god, and I'm looking forward to like the upgrade tree and everything. Look at all this cool lore shit of how he's made. Designing his friggin' circulatory system and shit. Oh my god. Dude, this shit is gr this game is fucking great. This practically is Bloodborne 2. Like, no joke. This shit practically is Bloodborne 2. Got a new arm as well. Traces of high powered energy originating far away. That's one mystery solved. Why don't we make a legion arm with it? Mr. Vanini is the expert when it comes to legion arms, but I'm pretty sure I can make one. The puppets get fried easily by electricity. If you use an electric legion arm, it'll make your life easier. You're going to the factory to save Mr. Vanini, right? 
He's the richest man in Krat. A little eccentric, maybe, but a good person. I heard he went to shut the factory down. Hmm. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. I know my way around a weapon. Where could this be changed at? At the, uh... It probably can be changed here. This game's on Game Pass, yeah. Oh, it's behind the girl. Kitties? What? All this cool lore shit, man. I know my way around a weapon. More of those. Qualification. The very other side. <laughs> like here? Oh, okay, okay. Needs an arm that holds powerful electricity, accumulates electric buzz, and discharges an effect shock. Like Nero arm. Cool. God damn, man. Well, I'm insanely impressed. This shit was fucking wonderful. Right? This shit was wonderful. I cannot wait. I love- I'm loving the story, I'm loving the fucking gameplay, I'm loving the level design. I'm fucking loving it. The reason V-Sync is tied to 60 FPS though, I don't know why. Oh man, 120. You guys start seeing screen tearing here, I'll have to see if I can fix that. Oof, 120 locked? Holy shit, 120 locked. I can't wait. I can't wait. Yeah, 120 locked. See some crazy shit over there. I'll have to try NVIDIA V-Sync, yeah. <sighs> oh man, now I'm tired. I'm just, I'm just blown away by how high quality the game is. I'm just... I'm just so blown away by how high... How polished everything is, man. Oh, and look, this part of the map is no longer all rainy and shit. It actually changed the time of day over here. Huh. Dope. Can I like full charge this thing? Damn. Jesus. Let me get this parry off. It electrifies them too. Yeah. The fact that you can break even regular enemy weapons is so sick.
That's such a cool addition that every enemy in the game you can like break their weapon. Man. Yeah, where the hell are the other starter weapons? Where are the other starter weapons? Where was that NPC? <gasps> was he over here? The first merchant had them, yeah. I think the first boss is this way. Yeah, here he is. Out here alone? Saber. Rapier. Great sword. Ow. So cool. Every boss fight I really enjoyed too, you know? Even the human boss fight guy was pretty sick. Now we did the quest with the lady by the window. We did. the different move set Cool Big knife Big knife. Yeah, the demo's pretty much over. We finished it. That really yoinks your poise. Or did I miss this? <sighs> so sick, man. Yeah, I think I'm just in love with this game. I think it's wonderful. I had such a great time with this shit, dude. It was so dope. So fucking dope.